Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Fate Stay Night Unlimited Blade Works. Um, so yes, I've learned of the cause of my problem. They have actually forgot to add in the Vita OP that would uh, actually play at that part in the story, causing a black screen to occur. Uh, now the good news is, I've learned that if I go to the patch settings and hit disable videos, uh, everything should progress normally. And if not, I've actually, I have got it to progress normally the one time. A patch is in the works, this is still beta, hence why there's all the problems, but I've been sending my stuff in and it's all good. Video games are crazy. We're also, again, if you didn't, if you skipped out halfway uh, from last time, uh, we're back in the square, uh, mostly because, well, it also, it was cutting text off the screen, which I didn't particularly like, uh, but it also, the widescreen was just cropping, which I would prefer to see the full picture, and I make them widescreen myself thanks to editing magic, so it's all good. So we are going to call back Saber, and we're going to skip ahead. And so, when we come back uh, to this, we fall down and have a not good time, and it is- I went too far. But that's okay. Fall unconscious. Okay, here we go. We're gonna go back one more. Okay, so. Okay, uh, what am I- I'm about to fall unconscious. We fall unconscious, and... Okay, that's the problem. If I- Oh, no, it worked this time. Good. It's like, am I gonna have to scroll back? No, we're good. Unlimited Blade Works, one day, three. We are back to play in the video game. It's all good. Oh, I should also say, I went to go see Captain Marvel today. And, hey, that's cool. Captain Marvel was a fine movie. But I actually, on the way, saw that they were, uh, they were playing Fate Heaven's Field Part 2. And, boy, I could have gone. I didn't. Because big, big spoilers. But um, my goal is to be able to watch Heaven's Feel 3 next year in the theater. Because it's just, it's, it, I actually felt like I was almost missing out, you know? Because now that I'm in, now I'm in. Anyways, it's a landscape I've never seen before. The fiery sky above, yeah, this is new. An infinite number of swords at my feet. Unlimited blades. Working, if you will. Are they traces of war? The world is inorganic, and there are no living things. Uh, it's going faster because it's technically read through text because I skipped over it. The ashen wind courses through the forest of swords. The swords stand like trees in a forest. It's not just ten or twenty. Not a hundred or two hundred. No matter how many there are, if it is impossible for them to be counted, they might as well be infinite or unlimited. The tools are rusting without anybody to use them. A ruin of infinite swords. He thinks that. It is like a graveyard. Wait, who? He? Who he? Who ha? Diddy Kong? Stain Coon! My vision returns. I don't know how long it's been, but I can feel the warm sunlight. I open my eyes and recall the dream I was having. That hill of swords. I'm sure I saw the dream because I saw Saber along with the fire in the cemetery. So that was weird because before we used to have the Saber dream. That is not a Saber dream. Oh! oh. Hi! You're in my room! Real close to me! Huh? Then, Tosaka Rin says this in her normal tone while looking down at me. <laughs> that is worth 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 exclamation marks. Goodness! I jump up. I instantly jump back to the wall to get away from Tosaka. Tosaka! He's, he can't handle it. My head spins. I should have been at that hill of swords. No, at the burning cemetery, so why am I asleep in my room? Oh, this is a nice mix on it. Tosaka! Why did you stay here? What did you do here? 
My head spins even more after I say that. It's not because of this surprising event. I'm surprised the most at seeing Tosaka right here when I wake up. It's causing my heart to beat at an abnormal rate. Tosaka is just acting cool. That snaps my groggy mind into focus. That's right. It's natural to be surprised at seeing Tosaka immediately after waking up. But that must mean... Is every woman in Shiro's life stronger than he is? Minus maybe Sakura, but we'll get there. <laughs> I wish she wouldn't say things that I could take as either insult or praise. She must be satisfied. Saying goodbye, Tosaka starts to leave. Yeah, that would be crazy. Staying in my house? <laughs> she speaks clearly. Her eyes say, we're enemies to me. That's true. Last night, in that church, I said I would fight. So we can only fight each other. Then, Tosaka stops and glares at me. She's like, no, this is what we do when we're enemies. <laughs> I don't know what she wants, but I'm sure it'll be bad if I don't obey. She taps on the tatami. It seems she has a serious matter to talk about. Well, I don't know about the key change of this song. It's slightly off the normal, huh? I sit down. And, you know what they say, people die when they're killed. I can't believe I read that line before! Tosaka speaks with a strong voice and sharp eyes. She's certainly right. If it's wrong to feel compassion for an enemy, it is also wrong to consider them to be just like you. Since I've decided to fight, they are only things I need to defeat. Yes, I understand her point of view. But... Well, but... Yeah, you big hypocrite. Isn't that a problem? Huh? Called out! Called out! Where did her previous attitude go? She grumbles angrily. It, it's not like I want to kill you or anything, but, but, but Baka? Oh, we're getting maximum Sundari this round, I'm sure. What? Stop with the flab on the mind. I don't like this. I hate that term. Well, I heard that phrase before. Yeah, yeah. 
Bad end, bad end, bad end. It comes. Here it comes. This is it. This is defeat. <gasps> We're gonna get super murdered. How are you this bad with women, dude? That was scary. I feel a chill and back up without meaning to. Tosaka stands up and leaves for sure this time. I kind of doubt that, but sure. With that, she disappears. It really must have been a whim of hers to carry me here and to treat me. She left with no regret or sentiment, leaving only the line that we're enemies. I take a breath and analyze the situation. I haven't had time to think since I saw that fight between Lancer and Archer last night. Finally realize. I was stabbed by Lancer after that and was saved for some reason. I was attacked by Lancer again. What I heard about the church, or what I heard at the church, the killings called the Holy Grail War. The Holy Grail, which grants any wish given to the winner. Can't absorb all the facts, but I have been attacked three times already, so I can't be confused forever. And most of all, I said I would fight since I could not ignore this battle. A fight for a single chair called the Holy Grail War. No matter what your expectations are, once you enter it, you can't survive unless you defeat your enemies. The problem is that defeating other masters might result in harm to innocent people, depending on your methods. That's why... <gasps> there it is. There's the line. Yorokobe Emyashiro. Don't know that part off the top of my head. To be a hero, you must have a villain, which is actually, I mean, for the time, pretty remarkable for a, for a plot thread. But I think as time went on, it became more and more like, yeah, I mean, sure. Oh, that was a weird flash. It shouldn't be a mistake. Emiya Shiro has been training in magic to become a superhero to protect innocent people. Yes. I shake off the priest's words and exit into the hallway. I eat breakfast time, let's go. I look through the house. I look everywhere someone could possibly, possibly be, including all the guest rooms, but I can't find Saber. She's gonna be in the bathroom, isn't she? Oh, it's gonna be since she came here, she probably brought clothes, huh? Even so, I can't find Saber anywhere. I guess servants can become spirits, but I can't turn her into one anyway. No, first of all... I don't understand who she is or how she exists. The only thing I can understand is... She was dope. But I'm confident I'll be able to win this strange war if I'm with her. I've searched throughout the house. It's a big house, but I didn't play hide-and-seek here with Fujine as a kid for nothing. I know the most efficient way to search this place. If she's nowhere to be found after searching this much, then she should be in the dojo or in the shed. Probably the dojo, right? We're gonna see her crouching down. Saber's in the silent dojo. But her appearance is different from yesterday's. Sitting in a Japanese fashion on the wooden floor, she is not wearing her armor. She's changed into refined clothes that suit her well, and is sitting silently. There's that screen! I lose my voice at the sight. Sitting Japanese style with her back straight and eyes closed, Saber looks beautiful, but not too beautiful, because that's not that route. Her state, melting into the silence, reminds me of pure water. Pure water. Anytime, any... <laughs> I can't do it. I can't do it. Water. It's so good. Just look up Lemmy Water and, and it's it's possibly the greatest video. That's all I could think about. And uh, that removes the final doubts within me. Even if she is a servant, I think she is holy. So I won't be led astray if I'm with her.
Yeah, Same and off. it's not like she'll turn evil or something later. <laughs> I mean, okay, that's that's not here. I think that's in the other one, but I am just guessing. At least that's what I think the altar thing is that I've heard about. That I call out. Saber slowly opens her eyes and returns my gaze. A calm voice. Her voice, echoing through the dojo as if permeating it, is surprisingly suited to this place. Ah. Saber looks at me as she speaks. Well, um, I feel tension, different from the kind I felt with Tosaka. Oh, hello. I can't get too close to you. It's forbidden love. I take a step back and shake my head. Looking away from Saber, who is tilting her head questioningly, I calm my pounding heart. Take a deep breath. But it doesn't seem to die down quickly. In fact, I don't think it ever will. I complain without meaning to. Saber's clothes are so real? Wait, what? Saber's clothes are so real. They are. They're clothing, dude. Clothing is a physical object that they make me conscious of her womanhood, whether I like it or not. She is terribly beautiful. I thought I figured that out yesterday, but she really hits me with it now. Perhaps her armor looked so surreal that I didn't notice yesterday. But when she dresses like a girl, I'm flustered, as any healthy guy would be. Shiro. I tense up the moment her eyes meet. But I didn't look for her look for her just to say nothing. I'm troubled, but I can't stay quiet forever. I make up my mind to talk to her. It's something I should have asked her the moment we got back last night. That if she really is my servant, she really is going to be joining this battle. Saber says so without the slightest hesitation. There's no room for me to question her about it. You know, you know what a butt dial is? She wouldn't, but just go ahead. Um, it's like that, but with a gotcha roll, pretty much. Here comes the big shock. Oh, wait, never mind. ま、I see. Then I should try to respond to her to the best of my ability. わかった。それじゃ、俺はお前のマスターでいいんだな。セイバー。ええ。ですが、シロ。私のマスターに敗北は許さない。あなたに賞賛がなければ私が作る。可能であるすべての手段を用いて、あなたには聖杯を手に入
Now that she says it, it's obvious something like a heroic spirit would never obey a mere human being. Since they have their own objectives, they serve the master in exchange. And that means Saber has a wish she wants granted. And it's a pretty big one, we know it. That is why Saber has no doubts. But... Doing something like what the priest said, involving innocent people and creating a disaster, like what happened 10 years ago. Yeah, you gotta be a real jerk to do that, am I right? シロ、それは可能である手段ではありません。私は私が許す行為しかできない。自分を裏切ることは私には不可能です。剣を持たぬ人間に傷を負わせることなど、騎士の誓いに反します。ですが、マスターが命じるのであれば従うしかありません。その
それぞれクラスに応じて選ばれているのですクラスそのセイバーとかアーチャーとかそうです元より英霊を丸ごと召喚するということ自体が奇跡に近いそれを七人分というのは聖杯でも手に余るその解決のため聖杯はあらかじめ七つの器を用意しその器に適合する英霊だけを呼び寄せたそれが七つの役割セイバーランサーアーチャー God, Archer's butt in that picture is incredible. It's just out there, huh? Casta. Assassin. Assassin looks like a big chuny. Berserker. The Berserker is a furry. Seihai wa, yakuari ni gaitou suru nōryoku o motta eilei wo ara yuru jidai kara maneki yoseru. So shite, klas toyu kara o kabutta mono ga servant to yobareru no desu. なるほど。じゃあ、セイバーは剣に優れた英霊だからセイバーとして呼ばれたってことか。はい。属性を複数持つ英霊もいますが、こと剣に関しては私の右に出る者はいないと自負しています。And if she is called as a archer, she uses a water gun, which we played around with in uh, Fate VR. There, God Grand Order is just some special, isn't it? もっとも。それがセイバーの欠点でもある。私は魔術師ではありませんから、マスターの剣となって敵を撃つことしかできない。剣謀術数には向かないってことだな。いや、それは欠点じゃないと思うけど、セイバーはあんなに強いんだから、もうそれだけで十分だろう。Root Force works sometimes. You just gotta hit hard enough, break through any shield. 戦闘で強いだけでは。この戦いは勝ち抜けません。No, we must be the strongest in battle. 例えばの話ですが、敵が自身より白兵戦で優れている場合、Punch him harder, harder than they've ever felt. え、あいやそうだな。正面から戦っても勝てないって分かってるなら、戦わずに何とかするしかな。Having said that much, I understand. The enemies are strong. You wouldn't fight a proper battle. Beating opponents with your sword isn't the only way to fight. You can't beat an opponent with your sword. All you have to beat them with is your brain. Play a game of chess against them. So you got this. Hakuhei-sen de sugure te iru to aite ni shirareta baai. Aite ya mazu Hakuhei-sen nado shikake te konai desho. So itta imi de yuto, nōryoku no ototta servant wa ara yuru te o tsukushite kuru. Assassin no servant wa nōryoku koso hikui desu ga. Well, some noble phantasms are more defensive, right? They're not they're not necessarily fatal attacks. Interesting that noble phantasm is just like a single, like two syllables in Japanese. That's not a term I've heard before. I think I might know what it means from the sound of it, though. Hogu to wa servant ga motsu tokubetsu na bugu no koto desu. Lancer no yari ya archer no yumi. Sore ni watashi no ken nado ga gaitou shimasu. Aiyu to wa sore tantai de aiyu to wa yobaremasen. Kare ra wa symbol to naru bugu o motsu ga yue ni. ヒーローとして特化している英雄とその武装は一つなのです故に英霊となった者たちはそれぞれが強力な武具を携えています or two or three or even four それがホーグサーバントたちの切り札であり私たちが最も警戒すべきものですセイバー says that noble phantasms are weapons that heroes wielded when they were alive I recall that blue knight. The lance had absorbed magical energy from the air and pierced Saber's chest with incredible movements. That was certainly not something fit for humans. I mean, it was at one time, kind of. The lance itself carried a strong curse, but I also felt an overwhelming amount of magical energy in the word Lancer said back then. Then could it be? Saber, Hogu is not a magic. 
ランサーの槍はいわくありげな槍だったけどそれ自体は槍っていう領域から出てなかっただろけどあいつの言葉であの槍は武器の領域から逸脱したそれって魔術の類じゃないのかええ確かにホーグは魔術に近い例えばランサーの槍です彼の槍はそれ自体がホーグではありますがその進化を発揮するのはマルクを注ぎ込みそ,その神明を口にした時だけです That's something important to note where it's like, yeah, if they're just using their sword as a sword, it's a sword. But when you, you know, give it meter, if you will, and say its name, that's when it's like, oh yeah, I'm a legendary weapon. Let's get this bread. Yeet. ですがこれにも危険はありますホーグの神明を口にすればそのサーバントの正体が分かってしまう I do find the, the balancing of this interesting where it's like yeah you're more well known you're powerful but you're less well known you might say your noble phantasm and people will be like who? what? I don't get it そっか英雄と武器はセットだもんな持ってる武器の名前が分かれば<笑> In the age of smartphones and Google, this changes everything. Of, oh, you said the name? Let me Google that. Oh, it says here you are, all your info. Scroll down to the weakness page on Wikipedia or like historical figures.wikia. Saber nods silently. That is why the Noble Phantasm is a trump card. In exchange for revealing the name, it launches an unavoidable fatal blow. When it does not prove fatal, the servant will expose all its weaknesses. So, saying that, Saber looks down awkwardly for a second. お願いってどんな私の神明のことです本来サーバントはマスターにのみ神明を明かし今後の対策を練りますですがシローは魔術師として未熟です優れた魔術師ならばシローの思考を読むことも可能でしょうああ名前は明かせないってことかそうだな確かにその通りだ催眠とか暗示とかいないとは思うけど他のマスターにマガン持ちがいたらベラベラ秘密を喋りかねないしよしそうしようセイバーのホーグの使いどころはセイバー自身の判断に任せる I mean this doesn't work out well obviously cause、uh, he figures it out pretty quickly その本当にそんなにあっさりと It's fine It's fine no worries あっさりじゃないぞ I thought it through deeply, just very quickly. Well, I get most of the stuff, but I still don't have a grasp of the situation. This is strange now that I think about it. Even though I've decided to fight, the only enemy I know is Tosaka, and I don't intend to fight her. Well, I shouldn't be thinking like that because Tosaka is ready to fight me any day. Nah, Seba. マスターやサーバントってなんか目印はないのかこのままじゃどうも勝手がわからないんだがいいえ残念ながら明確な判別方法はありませんただ近くにいるのならサーバントはサーバントの気配を察知できますそれが実体化しているのならなおさらですシローもバーサーカーの気配は感じ取れたでしょ I also saw him. He's ten feet tall. 襲われて初めてわかるなんていうのはまずいだろうせめて近づかれる前に気づかないと対応できないシロー wants some type of a knuckles chaos emerald radar that just beeps when he's nearby ではマスターの気配をたどるのはどうですかマスターとて魔術師です魔術をなりわいとする以上魔力は必ず漏れていますそれを探ればこの町にいるマスターは特定できるのでは After all, 
I didn't even realize the real identity of Tosaka. Goes to the same school as I do. We were in the same building for two years, and on top of that, I've seen her several times. I sigh. And then... Sure. Saber speaks with a serious face. A little tough with you here, but let's do this. I close my eyes. I feel something slightly touching my forehead. Hey, it's prickling. Could this be the end of her sword? Master, Yo, girl, cut your fingernails. Jeez. I see, so it's Saber's finger that's touching me. I pull myself together and calm down. Well, then... What is this? What? Yeah, whoa. What was that? Oh, so this time the status menu is a... It's not a book. It's a... Huh. Whoa, what? Can I go to status now? Okay. So this is about the same as before. It's mostly stuff that's the same. Yeah, I don't see any differences here right now, at least. Skills, instincts. So these, um, work with, uh, like in this mode, they don't show anything I haven't seen yet. I vote. Whoa! Hey, that's new. This is the, his, Ka Kaldabalg 2. This is said to be the demonic sword possessed by the hero of Ireland, Fergus, but. As the name suggests, it is a different weapon from Fergus's sword. Fergus was who fought, um, Cahulin, right? And Archer has applied improvements, particularly to himself. His noble phantasm, oh, right there, considered the natural enemy of Cahulin, the great hero of Celtic myth. If the wielder of Caldebogil is Ulsterborn, Cahulin has a duty to be defeated once by this sword due to his guise. I'm sorry, his what? His guys? Well, guys, you know what that time is. It's giggity giggity Google time. What is it, guys? Uh, idiosyncratic taboo. Vow. An action uh, is uh, something prohibiting an action. It's a... Uh, it's different. And then we got the unidentified axe sword. So this stuff will be added back into the main menu. Also, how's my relationship going? That's about normal. Um, the, that'll be added back into the main menu and like put back into the pool with everything. So that's how it works. Oh. Oh. So for me, I see a Dungeons and Dragons sheet because I'm a massive Spaghetti Lord nerd. Yeah, we just got a book last time. That's weird. I see. I was a bit surprised since it was so sudden, but it might be able to act a bit like a master now. Master, Whoa, hi. She asks me, leaning forward. I see. Saber is the same type as Tosaka. Attack first. Big strap energy. <laughs> oh, God, those comments. Those comments about big strap energy was the best.
Ah, well, we won't be doing anything different, he says. Saber narrows her eyes. They are the calm eyes of a swordsman who allows no disagreement. I stare back, try not to lose, and clearly tell her my intentions. ただ、それは戦わないって意味じゃないぞ。that's right. I don't feel anything toward the Holy Grail. But for a reason like that, I think I can fight with all my power and with pride. I actually master magic so I can uh, fix uh, Super Nintendos very easily, sell them online for a quick buck. That's right. So for now, I should try my hardest not to involve with any unnecessary people. Well, because winning means obtaining the Holy Grail, and most of all,中にはすごくいいやつだっているかもしれないけど、俺はセイバーの味方をするって決めたんだ。そのセイバーが聖杯を手に入れたいっていうなら、最大限手を貸すのは当たり前だろう。その親父の受け売りなんだけどね。正義
She says those words. That is big worries. What? Whoa. Status of weapon screen updated. Is this anything different here? I mean, probably not because we just took a look at it, right? So we'll see. We'll go lighter. He has clairvoyance. Oh, well, that's how he can... Well, I'm sorry. Okay, at higher ranks, let's him see through time. I was like, wait, wait a second. I don't know about that. Okay, and weapons. Yeah, so we, we got to take a look at that. We've skipped breakfast and it's noon already, so we decided to eat lunch. Saber can't turn into a spirit like Archer, and I'm not sending her magical energy like all the other masters are doing. It doesn't need to be said that this is because I'm an unskilled master. It seems like... She can see sleep to stop consuming magical energy, but doing so doesn't replenish it. So food will be your only source of energy. I'm in charge of cooking, so I can't be lazy about it. Ask her after clearing, uh, cleaning up our, our meal.活動している そして、その水滴を受け止めているグラスが私自身です。今の I, I don't remember this faucet metaphor in the other route, and it's really good for actually explaining how this works. So そう this is getting complicated now. Sum it up as I, her faucet. <laughs> sure, we'll go with that. I'm not giving her magical energy. She can only restore magical energy at a slow pace, the rate being that of just dripping water. Therefore, she should end battles quickly as she can and sleep right after to stop consuming any unnecessary magical energy. そうですね。ですが使えないということはありません。威力を抑えれば一度ぐらいは可能でしょう。何言ってんだ。そんなことさせられるか。セイバー、宝具を使うのは禁止だぞ。I place the tea in front of Saber. She frowns and reaches for the tea. Then, the phone rings. Telemarketers, am I right? I have all too good an idea as to who it may be, but I'm scared by the consequences of ignoring the call. Oh, I was expecting that to be someone else. I feel dizzy. She's the strongest one, the strongest in one regard. She simply discards all the chaotic events that happened since last night, and I feel like it's just a normal day. Hey, 
よ。おう。I thought she was in the room with us, but this is our spirit vision of her. Also, what teacher would do that? That's insane. It sure is strange. I feel like Fujine is right in front of me, puffing with pride. So, ga. Nara, second banash or stay by Janina. Cotinua, Kajimo, Drobomo, Sakas, Mokitanaikara. Anshin stay Bugatsdo, Nihagen de Gre. Try to cut off her conversation. I've been in trouble since last night, but it won't do any good to tell her that. Well, I guess she's in a little trouble right now, too. She's gonna be like, I forgot my lunch, right? Yep. <laughs> oh. So now we're Uber Eats, huh? We skip the dishes, huh? Jeez, what's up with that teacher? I say as I literally ordered takeout food today and got mad when it wasn't delivered on time to my work. Put on the apron I just took off. Well, we have leftovers from lunch, and the omelette will be easy to make. I care if Fujine's bock lunch and go out into the hallway. Saber follows me for some reason. I put on my shoes. When I look next to me, Saber is there, putting her own shoes on. Okay. Saber. I call out to her timidly. Well, I know what she's gonna say, but I have to ask her. I thought so. Well, this is something I have to tell her eventually. This is a good time, so I'll tell her now. And we know, statistically, there are no isolated places in Japan. Does she mean she'll be with me all the time? I hide my blushing face and take a huge breath to calm myself down. Damn, how stupid of me. I finally realized this important fact. This is what it means to fight alongside her! <gasps> Don't kid me. I'll go crazy before I even fight if you do that. <laughs> I won't give in, even if you look at me like that. いい加減にしてほしい。大抵の矛盾は我慢してきましたが、これは情報できない。あなたの方針はマスターとして間違いだらけだ。理由を聞かなければ従いません。Dear girl, Saber looks up at me. She's putting pressure on me, but I stare back at her. 理由なんてない。いいからおとなしくしてろって言ってるんだ。昼間は大丈夫なんだから、セイバーは休んでいればいいだろう。断ります。it would be embarrassing. <laughs> Saber freezes. Oh, 
Oh, I ran out the door. Man, this is pathetic, but I'm running away. And I'm doing it in front of my opponent, too! I run outside and slap my blushing face. Well, anyway. Saber should understand, since I told her so firmly. I'll apologize for yelling at her after I come home. That's a good idea. Alright, I think, guys, next time we're heading off to school to see Fujine at the club. Uh, not that club. Yo, if she would go clubbing, though, she would probably rock it. Um, and yeah, we will, uh, we'll have some more Fate Stay Night Unlimited Blade Works next time. Seems we finally reached a part of this with no problems. But it's also a part that is virtually indistinguishable from the original base game that I set out to play. Oh well. Uh, we're gonna hit that save button. And it is actually slightly more HD. Something that you probably can't tell, but... Uh, um, off to the club with uh, DJ Fujine. Oh, the tilde's too high. That makes me sad. I love the tilde. We'll see you next time for some more, guys. Ciao. Oh, hi. Before we stop, um, someone told me about something, apparently. And we're going to do this right now because I forgot. If you hold your mouse above here, it says, yes, hidden button is right here. Someone said I should click it. Hello? Yay! I'll, oh wait! Oh, oh shoot! 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 Just wait! Never mind. Uh, we're gonna return to the top because I I kept it on the ugly mobile graphics. Get rid of that! Get rid of that! Get rid of mobile. Go normal. There we go. Fix that. I don't like that. Okay. What is this thing? Okay. Yes, the hidden button is right here. What's it say? Yay! I'll cooperate. Really? Of course. Wait! Oh! Wait! This is okay. Really? Of course. Betraying to Sokka and selling her out. Betrayed by Sakura and getting sold out. And Baka Nichans are now born. I don't really get your high tension, but does that mean I can trust you? Yeah, but I'll betray you in the end. So, the 20 million powers route with Shin-chan starts here. Well, it would be if we had the time. Eject. Optimus Prime will appear too. Dead end. What? 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 Wakamane Par- Wak- Wakame, isn't that like seaweed paradise? Um... Ha- uh, okay. Can I get back to my save screen? C can I- can I get back to mine? Please? R return top? How do I change it back? No! Guys! I liked it! The other one was better! How do- How do I fix it? H help You guys ruined it for me. Unless I can click it again to change it back. Please? No! This ending, this is funny, but... How do I... It's even playing here! No! Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Let's return to the top. Okay. Let's exit. And let's return. And... Oh, thank God. Whew. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time for some more. Ciao.